Hey YouTube, this is uh, Rich. I'm relatively new to handgun ownership. I've got a Taurus PT 111 G2 and I got a holster here from Fox Holsters. Um, on their website it says that they've got a holster for PT 111 and uh, I really love this holster. Um, it's really comfortable. It, uh, it holds the gun well. And what I wanted to point out was, even though this holster uh, will work for both PT-111 and, if you can see here, it's for PT-140 as well, um, it works for the Gen 2s just fine. If I uh, take this, take my weapon and slide it in here, we can see that it goes right in and out of the waistband, the retention is not the best. Uh, but that's really not what these, this type of um, holster, let shake it out there. Uh, that's not what this holster is uh, known for, is to have good retention outside the waistband, but inside. So you can see there, we've got good coverage of the trigger just pokes through a little on the back side here um, it's got good coverage on the slide the only thing that I had to do is if we flip this over and we look down here right in here you can see is the mag release and I had to cut this little bit of leather right here and when I say a little bit I mean like less than an eighth of an inch just to carve that out because what I was finding was I would put the gun in and it would slightly depress this um, mag release and as you can see here all it takes is the little press and that's released so that was the only thing that I had to do to it um, I adjusted the the ride height and cant. It actually sits pretty level in my waistband. Uh, does a great job concealing the weapon. Um, the only thing with this uh, PT-111 Gen 2, um, these grips are really coarse. It is like a 60 grit sandpaper. Um, so if I don't wear a shirt, uh, it kind of rubs my skin raw. Um, the only thing that you could do to avoid that would be if you did not have this combat cut here and it just kind of came straight across like that but then that impedes you from getting your hand on the weapon as you're drawing it from the holster um, so I just wear you know either a, um, you know a, a light t-shirt um, all the time um, the backing on this is surprisingly smooth. I thought that was going to be a problem. That feels great against my skin. Um, no problem there. It is the rough side, but it is really smooth. Um, so no worries there. Um, they recommend that, uh, you know, once you find your ride height, that you lock it in with, with a little uh, Loctite. I have not had to do that yet. Um, there's, you know, this, this bit of uh, play on both side is not so much that the loose that the screw is loose but it's just the hardware that they're using uh, fits right inside so you're not really pinching um, against the the leather when you tighten that up you're you're just pinching the the, the hardware um, but like I said I, I've been wearing this holster now for a couple of weeks um, I really love it and again this is the Taurus PT 111 G2 and like I said it fits like a glove um, I have no retention problems at all um, and I just wanted to let everyone know that if you're looking for a, a great in the waistband um, holster hybrid type holster um, I'll tell you for the money you can't really beat it I think I paid somewhere around 40 bucks plus shipping on eBay um, Got the holster in, in uh, just under a week and uh, been using it ever since and uh, I really love it. Alright, that's it for now. Thanks everyone. Bye.